come to the question number four. Another two, three questions you will be expert in mathematical operation. More than that, not, not needed. Any level of question, you will be able to crack it. Because you will get the idea what are the variables can be used and how many type of number properties or mathematical properties can be used to set this type of questions. Question number four, if addition represent subtraction, subtract and represent addition this, this, which option is correct? This is type two question. This is type two question. Whatever we have discussed question number one, two and three, that was type one question. This is type two question. Means all four choices you have to verify. No alternative, you can't skip. Means you have to burn little bit more calorie and you have to burn little bit more time. You have to consume little bit more time, that much only. Question is not going to threat you, question is not going to challenge you and you are 100% sure you will able to make correct. But you have to put 5 to 7 seconds extra. Every choice we have to make correct, means you have to verify. Choice A, 30 plus 5 minus 4 divided by 10. Choice A, 30 plus 5 minus 4 divided by 10 into 5 equal to 58. 30 minus 5 plus 4 into 10. What do we have? We have just changed. Addition to subtraction, subtraction to addition, this, this. Is it coming 58 or not? No, it is coming 32, means wrong. Similar way, option B, just will do the same thing. It is coming 12, it is not equal to 22. It is was given 22, it is wrong. Again, this option C, 30 minus 5 plus 4 divided by 10 into 5, 62, it is coming 27, it is given 62, this also wrong. Means by default, D must be correct, but again just will verify. Is it okay or not yet? 41 equal to 41, this is 